good, Mr. Cat. Today, makers of Say Cheese announced a recall of 50,000 cans due to tainted ingredients. If experiencing hallucinations after eating, you're about to be very sick. So much cheese in every can, so yummily fantastic. How they do it, you may ask, it's magic, magic, magic. Did someone say magic? We can help with that, BT, can't we? <laughs> well, how else will you know what it's like to be a mouse? Friend? And remember, little Tommy, only the cat will set you free. But be careful, he's a handful. <laughs> I'm your fairy dog, brother. Got a problem with it? I'm here to give advice, got it? And right now, I'm advising you, watch out for the broom. The way I see it, you got two choices. You can stay a mouse, but that ain't going so well, is it? Or you can finally understand the grief you caused these little mouses. Only then will you be your silly self again. So what's it gonna be? No, no, no. You can't magic yourself out of this, mouse. I'm warning you. How's that magic working, pal? Ah, ticks. Is there a doctor in the house? A fairy dog brother's work is never done. I'm not a doctor, but I know one on TV. But bring this mouse to my office. Look at his foot. What seems to be the problem? He doesn't want to be a mouse no more. Oh, really? One of those mice. Have you learned your lesson? Ah! Oh, in that case... With my invention, I can effortlessly turn you into whatever you want. As long as it's a totally awesome four-legged shark, a somewhat useful duck-billed gerbil, or a lowly good-for-nothing house cat. Remember, Mouse, magic ain't gonna do it. This ain't magic. It's science. A mouse wanting to be a cat? You disgust me. But thank you for donating your body to science. We appreciate your trust, especially since we've never done this before. Fresh from business affairs, it's all pretty standard. Just sign there. Thank you. Ahem. <clears throat> Kitty boy, ever hear of a doorknob? So he has. Run for your life! <laughs> 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 